I think Hainan's a fantastic place. It's one of my favourite places in China. This is my fourth visit here in uh, two years, so that'll give you an indication of just how much I'm impressed by Hainan. I came here first in April of uh, 2018 for the Baal Forum, where I represented Malta and was the speaker there. I uh, came again last year for the Baal Forum as well and spoke on behalf of Malta there. And then last December, I came to Senya for the International Film Festival. And that was, wow, that was absolutely fantastic. Such a great time. And we had a very big Malta pavilion there because we have a number of Chinese movie makers who are now using Malta as their European venue for the filming of movies. And uh, that was a great way of exposing Malta here in, uh, in uh, Hainan. So, I'm looking forward to much closer cooperation between Malta and Hainan and uh, that's why I'm here now for the fourth time and I hope to have opportunities to come back here more often. Hainan is just going from strength to strength. Every time I come here I see more and more progress, more development, more things happening. You now have a uh, super highway around the whole island, you have a very fast train around the whole island, uh, that you're building this international free port, fantastic, it'll be the largest free port in China and one of the largest in the world. And of course in Malta we have had a free port since 1988. We have uh, many things in common. Malta is an island nation, Hainan is an island province, so the water and sea transportation is very important to both of us. We have a free port in Malta which has been there for quite a long time. There's a lot of Chinese investments. Um, Chinese company is one of the major shareholders in our free port. And of course it's my aim now that uh, Hainan is building this incredible free port to see a close link between the free port here in Hainan and the free port in Malta. So that we can use ships coming from Hainan to Malta and for Malta to act as a gateway to the other harbours of the Mediterranean. Well, I think the fact that it's, uh, it's new, it's forward thinking, the latest technology, um, and of course, sea transportation is becoming more and more important. We in Malta are located in a strategic place. We are right in the middle of the Mediterranean Sea. Strategic for the Mediterranean ports in the south of Europe, strategic for the Mediterranean ports in the Middle East, as well as in the north of Africa. So, because we have very deep harbours, it's very important for the big ships, the big container ships that will be leaving the Hainan free trade port to come to Malta to offload their cargo in Malta so that we can then store them in Malta and load them back onto the smaller ships to go into the smaller harbours around the Mediterranean. That is a huge link. We already do it in many other ports around China. We're now looking forward to doing it with the free trade port here in Hainan. We have a wonderful cooperation and as, as I indicated to the conference earlier today, we are hoping to build that cooperation even stronger by creating a sister island relationship between Malta and Hainan. That would be fantastic. So I really am looking forward to this being a major project and now pushing this to a conclusion.